Let's talk about adding bungee retention to pouches that you normally can't. In this case, we're gonna go through some STAC Kiwis, and we'll also talk about the Spiritus Mark IV. So before we do that, let's talk about why you'd actually want to use bungee retention. Really, it comes down to positive retention or over-the-top retention. In this case, we've got a bungee set up, one of our bungee retention adapters on this Glock magazine, and then the other option is basically having a flap on whatever pouch you're using. In this case, I'm using this flap to secure a multi-tool on this belt. So these are your two options. And the reasons for them are really uh, what your job requires. If you're on the flat range, honestly, you don't need over-the-top retention. But where it does come in handy is scenarios where you're going through a lot of dense brush. If you've ever been in a draw in North Carolina, you know what I'm talking about. Additionally, if you've ever been dragged in a med scenario or whatever it might be, or carried by your buddies, uh, things can turn into a yard sale really quickly, even if you're using something like Kydex inserts. So uh, over-the-top retention has its place. Additionally, if you're jumping or uh, doing maritime operations, it's a must. And then you're going to have some law enforcement agencies or units that require positive magazine retention. So those are sort of your whys. For me, uh, personally at work, I need this type of retention in some scenarios for both jumping and for maritime operations. So that's why I created these uh, bungee retention adapters. And you'll notice, eventually I'll do a gear breakdown, but all of my kit has the ability to add bungee retention uh, if whatever I'm working on at the time requires it. So that's really important to me. That said, I'm a big fan of Kydex inserts. The retention is solid especially something thick like with a PMAG or even with a regular magazine, you're going to get good retention. I've never had one of uh, these fall out on the flat range, but I have had things fall out of Kydex in more dynamic environments. But Kydex is great, fast uh, draw and re-indexing with really good retention. I'm partial to it versus just regular elastic retention uh, in most scenarios. So, Let's go over now how we could add bungee retention to this with our bungee retention adapter. When you get a bungee retention adapter, it'll show up like this. And you'll either get a pistol size in whatever length you ordered, or you'll get a rifle size in whatever length you ordered. And there's some standard sizes in the industry, and we go through the sizing guide on our website, but we also do custom lengths if you have some weird pouch. Haven't run into something yet that we can't accommodate. So we're gonna go ahead and set up this pistol pouch the same way that this one is right here. I've already removed the Kydex insert, and in this case, there's no loop uh, or hook on one side, but this side has hook. That is not a problem. That's one of the cool features of this. So when your bungee retention adapter shows up, go ahead and take off the rubber band, set aside your retaining band, and we'll get to those later. And install is really simple. You're just gonna take your Kydex insert, and you're going to align your tab with the top on one side and wrap it around to the other and put it in your pouch. Now a little kind of pro tip for inserting uh, really any sort of hook and loop into a pouch, but use a piece of cardboard or card stock or anything like that and shove it down into the pouch beforehand. These are just some folded up three by five cards. Once you've done that, go ahead and insert the uh, full Kydex wedge as far as you want it. In this case, I'm going for flush with the top. And then all you gotta do is just pull these out. And it'll be perfectly aligned. And now we've got retention tabs. From there, all I need to do is run my retaining uh, band. So I'll throw it through the back. Thread through the front. It's gonna be a little tricky at first, but go ahead and feed that through. Run it back through my second loop. And then I'm just gonna tie a double overhand knot at whatever amount of retention that I want and then I can cut off the excess and burn it. Now I've got retention. This is extremely secure. Once you add an item into your pouch, 
it's going to be even more secure. Again, you can adjust these to whatever tension you need, but this ensures that no matter what happens, this is not going to come off unless I need it to. Okay, so that's how it works on an S-Tac. Just to quickly show you that it works in any pouch, here we've got this Spiritus uh, Mark IV and got this set up in front with some elastic that already have retaining tabs. But then in the back here, got some Kydex inserts that don't have any way for me to add retention. So all I'm gonna do, take my rifle size one, and I'm gonna do the exact same thing that I showed you before. Now in this case, this is a full length or a tall one-year retention adapter on a medium-sized uh, insert from STAC. That's because it's sized for this pouch, which is at the tall size. But you could also use a medium here. Uh, I went with this tall option so that I would have the adapter all the way in the bottom of the pouch. And this would allow me, if I ever took this insert out, put other things in, I could actually just use this retaining, retaining tab anyway without the insert. So same principle, I'm gonna insert some pieces of paper, make my life easier. I'm gonna go ahead and slide in the S-Tac, pull these out, and now I've got retaining tabs. This concept works with really any kind of insert that you're gonna find out there. Could be an elastic insert, could be a kydex insert, could be a thermoplastic insert. The insert does not need to have hook or loop on it. As long as the pouch has hook or loop on the interior because they're reversible, you can add retaining tabs and then add your bungee retainer uh, to it. So again, if you're just on the flat range, this is probably not something that you need. But if you're a professional end user or somebody who wants to guarantee that you're not going to lose what you're carrying, then this can be a great option for you. And this allows you to have the best of both worlds of using great pouches like S-Tax, which I'm a huge fan of, but also in a way that I can add retention when needed for certain scenarios. Those are bungee retention adapters.